Using Donald Trump's way of speaking, how would you describe your day? You wouldn't believe it. I mean people all over are saying it was the hardest, probably the hardest ever popcorn kernel this world has seen, but I bit right through it, because I have very strong jaws. My teeth. People ask me about my dentist, they say, my god, you have the strongest, but I tell them it's because I eat popcorn. And I eat it very strongly. I got a laugh, you get an upvote. And I got a tell ya, it's the best post experts have ever seen. They tell me it's the best post on the in the history of the internet. And the internet has been around for you know, it's been around quite some time. Which is surprising, but not to me, because you have the best words and I know a lot about the internet, probably more than anyone. Believe me, we got a lot of work done today. Good work. The best. We got so much work done that, my dog, you know, she's the cutest thing. Poops on the floor. Can you believe that? If you don't give her treats. And that's the problem with Democrats. They think that, if you don't give them treats they should poop on the floor. Can you believe that? We don't need any more treats. Because we have the best people. The best people. Not like the neighbors. They grill hot dogs outside sometimes. In their backyard. Totally legal, I guess. I didn't know you could grill dogs, but maybe someone should look into that. I didn't read any of these before I posted mine. You expanded on my general description of my day at work. Excellent work, my fellow hard worker. This thread is gonna be fantastic. Tremendous. I did the most housework ever done in a day, really, no really, many people are saying they've never seen pictures hung strayer or smoother dry wall patches, folks. I mean it, it was the most successful day, even the dogs said so, I'm their hero. I'm a very successful drywall patcher the most successful. Nobody patches a hole like I do. This one got me. The problem is that today was a day that was not good. You look at what is happening here, you know what is happening here. We know the problem. Look, I'm in my house. People aren't coming from Sweden. Swedenish people are wonderful. Not the best, but really good. Okay. But they're not here. Why aren't they here? We can't find out the problem until you find out the root cause. I want to find out the problem. I have had so many people call me and say thank you. People from Sweden. So many people from Sweden. So now you see people talking, saying Paradoxmas has a point. Thanking me for solving the problem. They call me, and they say to me Paradoxmas we have a problem and we need to know how to solve the problem. What's great about this one is that it veers off topic almost immediately. It's got me scratching my head, and trying to guess why you're talking about Sweden. Did your IKEA furniture not get delivered? That's perfectly Trumpian. To leave them wondering what the duck you're talking about. Look. I've had many days. Many days. Lots of days are good. Some are bad. Some are bad. I don't pay attention to those days. You know why. Do you know why? Them. All of them in the back row. Fear always saying how bad the days are. But guess what? I've had a great day. Im having a great day. And fear not going to say anything about that. They just want to talk about a hoax. I don't like that. I don't think anyone likes that. I like good days. Good days. I don't know why, but my brain insists on reading this as Charlie Day. It was a great day, the best day in a long time, actually. I talked to many people, some good people, you know, the very best, and this one. Fine lady, very beautiful, she drafted up some paperwork for me to sign. Very important papers, bigly. And I tell you what, she says she had a dog that she sometimes brings into the office, but she she didn't bring him today, so to that I said, the Obama administration prevented you from bringing your dog today, and then wonderful people, wonderful employees, they served me iced coffee, so, coronavirus isn't all that prevalent, need less testing, and this paperwork, very important, very sad, sleepy Joe Biden couldn't have signed it gotten it drafted, not in a day like me, very sad though, but very necessary. It's Mexico's fault. Real story. Got divorce papers drafted today and then indeed bought iced coffee. Close bracket. Lol. Sorry about your divorce though. Today I had a day. A great day I I. A nice day I I. And I was watching TV and I saw. 
Family Guy, the great family guy I, I did. And he got in a chicken fight again, and they said has the family guy and we like that. Has the family guy. I can tell you who didn't have a great day. An awful day, probably. Fake news. Had a terrible day, probably, maybe. Liberals probably ruined the day. Nasty nasty liberals, you see, Obama. And we have to make the day great again. Fix mistakes the awful liberals made. So many mistakes. The worst mistakes of the world's history. Sat. This actually sounds the most accurate. Listen folks, a lot of people, and I mean a lot, say working for 9 hours is just too much I can't be productive. But that's not true, is it folks? Especially with the China virus. You got your work from home, TV on, boss forgets to tell you what project to work on, but you know, right? Of course you do. Working from home is the best. You're not playing video games, no. The mainstream media with their fake news reports that you can't be productive working from home but I'm so productive, the most productive, the best. First you got your team's chats, then your zoom meetings. Zoom meetings, folks. We need to make zoom great again don't we? Didn't they get hacked? I don't know. Fake news. The media blamed it on the Russians. Why is it always Russia? Well, we can make it great again, don't you think, folks? Anyway, working from home is very productive. Even for 9 hours, I think even 10, or 20. Why not 30 hours a day? But no pay increase. People are so entitled. Rent is like what? $100? You can earn that on $7.50 slash hours. I know people who could make that on $7.50 a week. Wouldn't it be nice if wages were capped at $7.50 slash week? Wouldn't that be nice, folks? Imagine the economy. The economy is great now the best but just imagine it. But you know what would be better? If we didn't have to pay people at all. That would be the best. But not for folks like us. We're millionaires, right? We're smart, folks. The smartest, you guys know better. But the Democrats and immigrants, they should be working for free. Questions? Reporter, did you just suggest slavery for your political opponents? Who are you? Who are you with? Okay we're done here. Mainstream media. Folks. Fake news. Get them out of here. Edit. You know, I always say the comment system is rigged, folks. And it is rigged, but we're just that tremendous. Some people say platinum is the best award, but we know better. We know better. What's more valuable than gold? Nothing. My toilets are gold. My towers are gold. I would dip my own daughter in gold, if he'd let me. The 30 hours a day got me. He would say that, and then later deny he said that, and insist he is very smart and bigly educated. The fake news media loves to report on how I do nothing but people everywhere say I'm the most successful okay. My uncle, very smart, University of Phoenix online okay. So when you have this lying media and him having the most successful day, maybe ever okay. Listen your day can't compare to mine, because business and you know, I'm very successful at, that you can't even compare our days. I had the greatest day in the history of days. Despite the negative press cub thief. Look many people say they have bad days. Many people. Some worse than others. But no one has ever had a worse day than me believe me, I know bad days and let me tell you, they are in good low energy sad awful day the likes which you wouldn't believe, my husband lost his job. Today sucks. We're going out to dinner and eat our feelings, so that's good. This deserves more upvotes, just for the hand gestures. Beautiful day. Big numbers. I cooked and ate more macaroni and cheese than perhaps the world has ever seen. It was a tremendous accomplishment for this country, truly. To eat this food, that's so sacred to our nation, made me appreciate how much the people of America mean to me. The crooked Democrats running fake news want you to believe I never made the macaroni. That's just not true. Nah raah, that's more complex and even has full sentences. I worked. I worked very hard. Very hard, and very long. People emailed me and said, are you still working? You're still working? I've never seen anyone work this hard and long. Never. I didn't know this was possible. They tell me they've never seen anything like it. They only work maybe half as hard and long. But not me. I'm just all there, you know. I'm all there. 
so that's what I did. I worked very hard and long, and it was great. Just really great. Tremendous. Good. Very many good things. Much good. Not bad. The best even. Much good going on. Lol it kinda sounds like doge. Much good. I went to work today, and it was very good. It's a very good thing to do. Going to work. And I worked hard. I did good. Great. Tremendous amount of work I did today. It's important work I do. Essential work. God bless essential workers out there on the front lines of corona. Dramatic pause. Virus. Doing good work. Essential work. Every day. For the benefit of millions and millions of people. Good people. Good American people. You got me till corona. It's a BV China. Dramatic pause. Virus. It was good. I did the best of things with very good people. The best. Best people were on the job. And it got done good. We didn't let the people do a bad job. Because we are the best. If we let them do it then it won't have been done good. I have the best words. The best. My house has not been condemned. Because of fire damage. That's fake news. They're just jealous of how hot it was. I'm not going to be homeless. If I don't find a place soon. The world is my home. And it's the best world. Some parts of the house was fire damages. Yes. But not all the parts. Some parts are good parts and nobody talks about the parts. That didn't get fire damages. Everyone talks about the damaged parts. But what about the firemen? Or women? Some firemen could be women these days. Possibly. I don't know. But what about the firemen and their hoses? That saved a lot of the house. Nobody talks about the great work our firemen do, because I think they did that, and you were very smart when you called them. Man. Woman. Coffee. Chips. Beer. They ask me 20 minutes later. I said man. Woman. Coffee. Chips. Beer. It was easy for me. You got extra points for getting them in the right order. We've never seen that before. Amazing. Tremendous. We're going to make depression great again. No one's depression is worse than mine. No other person that has lived has had depression like me. Depression, some say, is horrible. And it's true. My depression is worse than anyone who has ever had depression. Not everyone knows this. But those who suffer from depression also have anxiety. Not everyone knows that. It's true. Anxiety. I have anxiety and it's tremendously soul crushing. No one knows how badly anxiety treats me. Describing my lazy day off, I've had the most productive day in the history of productive days. No one, no one can even come close. I've got so many things done. So much important stuff. This made me snort laugh. Thank you. The Democrats have stated strongly that they don't approve of how I changed my baby's diaper. It was great for the baby. What a beautiful baby. The Republicans, therefore, didn't want to ask how they would have me do it. Dems, as usual, are hurting the working men and women of our country. This is the one reply that made me laugh. What a nasty question. Boohoo some might say it was the nastiest question. They ask me the people ask me which question is nastiest. Well I say to them, because I'm good at telling, if a comment at nasty, some might say I'm the best at telling nasty comments, I say to them, that this was the nastiest comment. It's true, I said it, and most people think, that I'm always right, I'm always correct. Those people, coming in without masks, with their bare faces everywhere, very un-Canadian. Some are even sick, very very sick, the worst ever, no mask. And the people, they say they won't use the hand sanitizer, because it smells funny. This is the best sanitizer, very effective, very affordable. I'm going to build a barrier, a huge barrier, a barrier of chairs, the best chair barrier ever, and they're going to pay for it. I tried, I'm a covered screening RN at a hospital. Ugh I hope you're okay. Thank you. I've had the best day. No one has had a better day in the history of the country. Even the experts ask me, how can you have such an amazing day? Reporter, Mr. President, CNN reported th. Fake news. You're a terrible person. Democrats are bad. My day is the best. With those little up buttons. Bing bing. I finished the first week of a virtual air force course today. Very important course. 
Lot of material. Very impressive stuff. Gotta do it on the computer. People think I'm not good with computers. I don't need to know how they work to press the keys. I'm very good with computers though. Very good. Very smart. Took a typing clap once. Typed many words per minute. Might have been a record. Some kid in China probably has the record. Very efficient people the Chinese. Very efficient. Gotta bring jobs away from China and back to America. Before I talk to you about today I just want to let you know how great we're all doing over here. There are really a lot of good Americans working hard out there to kill the Chinese virus. You know I think the answer of how today went isn't important. What's important is that tomorrow will be great. Next question. That was a terrible question and you are a terrible person for asking. Tremendous. I won't get into all of it because I'm a busy man with places to go and people to offend, but since I've got a minute, I had a great sleep, maybe the best sleep I've ever had. I had a dream you guys wouldn't believe. Those Koreans, man they may be horrible people, but they make a great couch, maybe the best couch in the world and very few people would disagree with me on that. I had some breakfast, a wonderful breakfast. We really do make the best breakfast in the world in this country don't we? We have the best chickens who lay the best eggs and the best yeast birds that lay the best bread. And the coffee. I mean wow, those Colombians. Where do you even find Colombians? We need more of them. Not in America, but we need more of them making coffee because that was a great cup of coffee. Ask anyone. Ask Mike Pence. He'll tell ya. I gave him a sip and now he won't shut up about how great the coffee was. After that I watched TV all day while I stayed inside to avoid the China virus that China sent us from China. And by the way, I watch the best shows, shows you guys wouldn't even be smart enough to understand, but I'm already on season 4 of all of them because I'm that smart. Alright it's been great talking to you, but I've got to go play golf and watch us win some more. D. Great. I woke up this morning you know, and I left for work. As I headed to work, I started thinking about a quote from George Washington. A lot of people don't know this, but he was our first president. I know it, always have, but he said some words. Very fantastic words. And I got to work, and people just couldn't believe it. The things I did. Very impressive things. The best things. But, yeah no, I was treated badly. These people always treat me badly, and, the quote from George Washington, it's such a quote, and he was a great man. Some people say I'm a great man too. Maybe a better man than him. I know. I know. And these people want to pay me. I always ask, if Benjamin Franklin got paid. I've seen his face on some money and that's how you know he was good. Let's just say, I've seen his face a lot of times. Probably more than anyone, and he was the best president. I'll tell ya, things aren't looking good folks. I was on my way home and there were people. And they were everywhere. I wondered why the people were there. It's because they weren't somewhere else. That's a shame. They could have been somewhere else. But they weren't. Because they couldn't be. Everyone wants to blame me. Blame blame blame. And these people have probably never met George Washington or Benjamin Franklin. But I know them. I know more presidents than probably anyone. And they always say, they always tell me, you're doing the best job. And no, I didn't leave early. Even though I had finished my work. Hard work. And they know, that America has a flag. Only thing this is missing is a G. Washington quote that is actually from FDR or Patton or someone like that. That's a nasty question. Next. Absolutely perfect the best. I've heard some people say it was way better than anyone else day, except maybe, of course, Honest Abe, Abraham Lincoln. It was you huge. I did bigly things. Best numbers of anyone ever in the history of people. The most khaki least day I have ever seen. This guy is great. I mean it. I've had cake with him and this day, let me tell you. I mean it. This guy and this cake is the best. I mean it. I had sex. Tremendous sex. You've never seen sex like this, let me tell you. Boys, girls, sex traffickers of all ages. Productive day. Very productive. Did many things, the best things. Cuff thief. That's a nasty snarky question. 
Damn this is good it's going over some people's heads too. People this person is literally quoting Trump. They are not actually saying that the question is bad. Sat. These are all way too funny. I can hear every one of these in his voice and I love it. Shower. Car. Work. Food. Bed. It was fantastic. The best day ever. You should have seen how amazing my morning was. Absolutely incredible. They said yesterday was the best day ever, but you know how fake news is, they exaggerate everything. I told them, Friday is always better than Thursday, am I right? I found out my dog might have cancer, the greatest, most amazing cancer. We will spend lots of money, more money that has ever been spent on a dog, to make his kidneys great again, but I will be making my wife pay for half of the vet bills. This guy's dog, and I've seen a lot of dogs, believe me, absolutely top notch. The best. High quality, American made. Always there, always hard working, got a lot of people rallying behind him. We have a team of doctors, and some would say, the best doctors, working around the clock, to bring him back to full health. Better than ever before. I hope it all goes well, man. I'm rooting for you, your wife, but most importantly, your dog. Close bracket. I'm being viciously attacked with lies and smears. I think it's a disgrace, and I say that, and I say that. I was in the car for hours. The left says 2, I say 12 hours. That's Trump dexterity. I would like to see wonky Joe Biden sit for 12 hours. Sat. I then talked to a man. A powerful man. I know many men. So much power. Power is something my father taught me taught me many great things. He was a great man, like Richard Nixon. MAGA. Person woman man camera TV. This answer deserves more credit. You know we are making tremendous tremendous efforts with our days. A lot of productivity. A very high amount of productivity is going into our days. They ask me how, can you be so productive? We didn't think it was possible. I tell them I just have good genes. Some of the best. China actually wants to do research on my productivity genes. That's something we are looking into very closely. You don't see China or other gene people asking Joe these questions. Which I think, tells you quite a lot about him. You don't see Joe having these productive days that I'm having. Unproductive Joe I've heard people call him. Translation, I got nothing done today. I went to the hospital, and let me tell you, the doctors were so surprised how tough I was with so much pain. Someone must have made the floor on Evan, and I tripped, and hid my eye into the corner of a table and my eye black and needed really quick, like so quick. Man I gotta tell you I really scratched my corneas, but the doctors could not believe how stoic I was with my eyes well in shut, more shut than anyone's eye has ever been, and with such bad scratches on my corneas. And by the way they told me I have great eyes, best eyes they've ever seen. They told me it will take 3 or 4 days to heal the scratches, but the eye will stay swollen for some time, but since it's me, it will only take 2 days maybe even 1 day, because I'm the fastest healer, ever. I could regrow a limb, if I wanted to, honest to god I could. Anyway, it was Obama's fault. Thanks Obama. The swelling will disappear in the fall. People say there'll be a second wave of swelling, but no, you know, maybe you should pour some bleach on it. Maybe someone should look into that. Cavfeef. I drove my car, a great car, maybe the greatest car, made by the finest people, around my hometown, which is magnificent, the greatest town, filled with very good people. Person, man, woman, camera TV. I have a friend who collects plants. That's what she does. She's the biggest in town. She collects plants like house plants, potted plants, that's all she does. She doesn't collect stamps, she doesn't collect antique coins. She collects plants. I said to her the other day, how are you doing? She goes, unbelievable. Oh, great, that's good. Thinking about the garden, right, because she's standing in her garden. So I said, good, so the garden is doing well. She said, no, no, not our garden. Yeah I've got to see what I'm doing in the conservatory. She said, the growth there is unbelievable, the new plants we are collecting. We are moving plants in from the garden. That's what she does. Potted plants. You understand? 
Bing bong. Wall. WRLL. So much work was being done. Great work. The best work. Well, some of it was the best. Some of it was just okay, but we are not gonna talk about that right now. Today was great. I did things. I did a lot of things. You know, it's tough doing a lot of things. I hear China's doing a lot of things. Yes fellas and they don't stop folks. They, they do things that hurt our trade. And it's nice. Traders. We do a lot of trade. It was busy. I was busy. Very busy. Incredibly busy. I'm a busy guy. Driving around and fixing stuff everywhere with a tool. A screwdriver. The best screwdriver. A powerful screwdriver. I would say the best screwdriver where you flip the switch and it clicks one way. And tightens or loosens the screw the other way. Amazing invention. Really caught on after I bought it two years ago because of me. I told everyone. You should get one. And now everyone has one. It was a good day, some may even say it's the best day. No one has ever had a day greater than I have had today. Ask anyone, and they will tell how just how great my day was. In fact you could even call it good, because good is a great word. And great words are the best. China. I grabbed my pussy. I see my pussy. I grab it, and it'll let me because of me. We got a lot done today, folks. A lot. We are getting ready for a big big move. Huge. People are saying it's the biggest move ever, and we are doing it. We are ready for it. Big beautiful boxes, like you've never seen before. Just incredible. Ready to go. And they are sitting here, beautiful, waiting for the landlord to give us the key. They hate me. I called them, and I was very nice. I was very nice, even after they weren't very nice to me. But don't worry folks, because they knew they didn't have anything. Biggest witch hunt in history. Cleared of everything. Absolutely everything. But they are still making us wait until Monday. But that's okay. We shouldn't have to wait. The people want to see this move. They want to see those big beautiful boxes. I know you do. I do too. But we'll wait. And those monsters? Folks, I'm always saying it. I say it every time. Even if the fake news doesn't want to tell you. The fake news says it's fine. Folks, they've gotta go. And I'm going to get rid of them. We've gotta get rid of them. All the hunters are saying that the monsters have to go. Too many monsters. The Democrats don't want the monsters to go. And some of them, I'm sure are very nice Paolumu. And the Democrats let them in. And you know what I heard they do. They make them into hats. Can you believe that? They let them in. And they make them into hats. And they let all these monsters into their hunts, but then the Devilge Ho and the Basil Juice show up too. They're hiding out in those hunts too. We can't just keep going on these investigations with these invaders. Someone has to stop it. That's what I've been saying. That's what everyone keeps saying to me. You've gotta stop it. And folks, I'm the only one who's gonna stop it. You think those hunting horn mains are gonna stop it? I'm gonna stop it. I'm gonna stop it so fast you won't believe it. I've got a team of lungs wards ready to go. They're just waiting for me. Strong meter lungs wards. We have the best lungs ward mains in the world, and we are gonna use them. We'll clean up those hunts, like you wouldn't believe. And we'll move, as soon as they give us those keys. I don't want to make you wait. They are making you wait. But that's okay. They know they can't stop it. They are making you wait, and it's not fair. But we are going to get those monsters and we are gonna get those keys. And when we move, it's gonna be like no move you've ever seen before. Today I had billions and billions of ideas. Yet today, I had zero cases of me committing to them. Good things are happening I can't name it one but it is. I'm winning. China 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 China
China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China China Sat Fantastic Utterly Fantastic I'd like to see Sleepy Joe do better but thanks to the Dems I had to work on the front yard I did many things many 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 things some other days from other people not many things happen. Hardly anything happens in fact. But my day many things happened. But you don't want to report on that. No that's not good for you to report on. So you will report on the many other things. The many other things that didn't happen. And that. That's just riddlecus. Because truly. All the things happened. And they happened today. I did them. Truly. It's amazing. Great day. Very productive. I achieved a lot of great things today. I'm brilliant. You know my dog. She's the cutest dog in the country. She knows all the tricks. Great dog. I took her to the vet. Best vet in the area by the way. My dog needed grooming. So I took her to the vet. She looks stunning now. I've received compliments on my dog by many many people. In reality I procrastinated all day and haven't finished my homework. My dog is the cutest dog in the country though. Tremendous. I was cognitively there all day. Desk. Chair. Telephone. Meeting. I have, like, a good memory. There I was. And you know it was morning. I have good memories of mornings with my dad you know. Odge. Orange juice you know. They call it Odge. Odge. Oh 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 jay. Wow I gotta tell you. There's a messed up guy. That's what America lost. Odge. The glove didn't fit. Got her a quit. America lost a lot since those days. Morning papers and orange juice. Back when America was great. But we are going to make America great again. That's why we are here. Isn't it? MAGA. America is not what it used to be, let me tell you what, we are making America great again, but these radical left, let me tell you something folks, a lot of people don't know this, but the Model T was a great car, Henry Ford, now there's a great American, provided a lot of jobs, good jobs, they just don't make them like they used to, you should see the car, the motor arcade, that's what they call it, what the secret service puts me in, I ask if it's American made, but it's not, it's from China, China, that's why I go in the, in the you know, the buzzy thing, the heli, us heli, a copter, that's American made, not like these cheap Chinese cars everyone is driving, let me tell you, it holds up well. It's nice up there, looking down on you little people, I mean not like midgets, heh, but that would be funny, like the midget clowns, they still do that trick, where they stuff a bunch of midgets in a car, probably outlawed by the radical left, not politically correct anymore to have a circus, not humane they say, gotta shut it down, Peter all upset about the animals being mistreated, wah wah wah, let me tell you, those whimpering democrats. Hell yeah this guy knows what I'm talking about, little crib babies, wah wah wah, that's what those liberals sound like. Do you actually write Trump's speeches? Very bad terrible waking up very bad worst trade deal in history I take no responsibility. Too much Cuvif this morning. Way too much. Huge amounts. Very big. Wow. Very big day. Good day. I performed good on a test. All questions right. Bet you cold and even perform good. Amazing skills I have. Brilliant. Much wow. This morning I was reading. I was reading this book. Amazing book. One of the best. And I'm reading many pages. More pages than anyone. Perhaps in the history of. And nobody knows history like. Many people have said so. Good people. And I know people. Some of the best people. Folks. I'm reading. And people are always telling me. They say my reading is off the charts, and they don't even like 
Doctors they ask me how it is possible that I can read so good and I tell them I always, even from the very youngest, and they say it is not possible, like medically not possible, but I, I have always been a great reader. So I'm reading this book and drinking coffee, and many people don't know this but coffee, coffee can be very hot, you know and I have people come up to me and tell me, sir they call me sir, everywhere I go I get great, you know, great respect from people, so sir is what they call me, or sometimes mister, octopus, people tell me, sir, you are doing the right thing, and that is what I'm trying to do. I know a lot about programming, some. Many people say how good my code is. No tests. First build always big success. I had a great day, believe me. I've had people tell me that they've never seen a better day than mine. I'm gonna ducking jump off a cliff if this day goes on one more minute. Hey buddy, how you doing? Need someone. An average day, believe me, believe me. I know a lot about days. Maybe the most average day in the history of days, maybe ever. I barely did anything of note today. Tomorrow may be boring, it may be exciting, who knows. I deliver pizzas on a bicycle. I think that's too complicated to describe with Trump's vocabulary of 300 words. Wow. That's a nasty question. Why don't you ask Obama how his day went? Or Sleepy Joe? A lot of people are saying he had the worst day ever so why don't you report that? Fake news folks. Fake news. Nasty. Terrible question. That's a terrible question. I just took a chis. God bless America. Fake news. It was. A great day. A truly amazing day. Maybe the best day. Ever. Ask my mom. My brother, anybody, they'll all tell you that it was a fantastic day. Someone might even say an exemplary day. My dad just called me to tell me how much of an amazing day it was. That's how great of a day today was. The best day, thus far, by a lot. Some people, some fake reporters, very fake reporters try to tell you that it wasn't the best day in the history of ever, but don't let them fool you. Trust me, it was a remarkable day. It was great okay, believe me, okay. Unlike what some people, terrible people, really, many people day, that these people calling my day bad were terrible people, will tell you I'm a couch potato. Can I say that? Of course I can say that, when you're lazy they let you. Trust me, they really do. I then had some frosted flakes, they were honestly tremendous, and I think, that Kellogg's is a great company, okay, great company. I then sat down, again, okay, again, and play video games. Some may tell you playing video games is bad, but trust me they really aren't. I then skipped lunch, since I wasn't hungry. When you're not feeling hungry they let you skip lunch, they really do. In the afternoon I had to go outside, terrible, terrible really. Some might call it greatly bad, that's a new term many people have been saying but I invented, trust me, okay, trust me. I then chased a gopher, since they are eating our crops and thanks to my tremendous effort it was chased back into the hole, no more bad hombres. But they will come back, unless we do something huge, something tremendous, it's true, I googled it. When I went inside, very tired I had a quick dinner, very quick okay believe me, watched some TV, really did, and then started going on reddit. Tremendous day, really despite what the fake news siblings will tell you, I had a tremendous day with no bad thing at all, okay trust me, believe me, looking forward to another tremendous day. Oh my, you watched until the end? That's ducking awesome dude. Thanks for watching.